Hello everybody, between playing regular games on my laptop, from time to time I enjoy getting into virtual reality and well, doing some exercise with some games. Uh, I got a bit of weight and I wanted to, you know, kind of get into shape and I decided to search for some games and playing Beat Saber and playing Racket and X, but this one, this one was, well, wow. This game is called The Thrill of the Fire. This is a realistic boxing simulator in virtual reality and I downloaded it from the Oculus Store. I'm playing this one on the Oculus Quest 2. So basically, well, like I said, it's 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 a realistic virtual reality boxing game. So you have a gym where you can try a different type of uh, machines that allow you to practice your boxing. And of course, as you can see here, get into the boxing ring, a virtual boxing ring and fight different opponents. You try. This is, by the way, the first one It's quite easy, but still uh, yeah, I'm not used to working with my fist, if you know what I mean. So for me, this was a good workout. I mean, I did like 45 minutes today uh and uh it was it was hard i was sweating i was sweating and i i felt that i really i did a good a good workout today playing this game now of course it's not for everyone but if you like boxing and you want to feel kind of feel of the fight of boxing and maybe learn a bit of kind of self-defense in a way maybe uh well uh this game is for you but i definitely can see this uh as a popular game for those who are searching for a workout game and don't like the you know the the regular uh, fitness virtual reality games that are focused kind of, you know, on working on this muscle, second muscle. People just want to stay with the game that they enjoy, but also the one that will allow them to kind of work out their body where they can sweat and feel their muscles are working. You know, a game that will be motivated to play uh, on a regular basis. Now, as you progress, you're going to find out harder opponents, although you can choose the difficulty I'm playing on normal, <laughs> but you can uh, choose higher difficulties. And trust me, this is this is not easy. This is definitely not easy. I mean, if you ever try to kind of, uh, with, you know, in a fun way to fight with your friends, you know what I mean. You know, you need to be in shape in order to kind of uh, keep up with those movement of your body. I mean, you can get really tired really, really fast. Um, so this one actually can get you into shape. Uh, and I really enjoyed this. This is a tougher opponent after the first one. And it took me some time to actually beat him off with a knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, with the match ending in the third round, your winner by technical knockout, the red corner. I think that fight alone was like, I think like close to 10 minutes. I mean, just think about it in workout time. I don't really want to finish him off and it be quite bad. Uh, anyway, yeah, exercise and you can, you know, some fights maybe take even longer. This one was able to knock out, maybe others I won't. Uh, but it's fun. It was fun. The most important thing that it's fun because if it's not fun, you won't, you won't be kind of uh, encouraged to actually uh, uh, continue playing it. And funny thing is that I don't even mention the word working out right now because again, if you play it and enjoy it, well, you don't going to do workout, but actually, basically, you're going to just enjoy game. I can see there was a speed bag before and now this kind of dummy, which you need to hit. And it's pretty cool because you can actually measure uh, you know, the, how fast you actually hit. Uh, and you can check the damage, the stats on the right side which actually measure your highest, most powerful punch. Although it's very important to keep in mind that you need a 6.5 by 6.5 feet play area, 2 meters by 2 meters, because, uh, well, as you can see, I, I actually I actually cheated. I just uh, used a, uh, 2 meters by 1.5 meters, and actually when I did a left hook, here, actually here, I hit the wall drop. And actually, uh, nothing happened to my controller, but it was kind of a scratch, a little kind of a... Uh, so, again, make sure you have room to play this game. Seriously, don't make the mistake. I could have broken my controller easily playing this one. Now, there's also the heavy uh, punching bag, uh, which I like less. I don't know, it just felt... I wish there were controllers, it just felt better. You know, kind of force feedback. Uh, just to feel better. Hopefully, in the future, we'll have those one. Then, it's going to be amazing. So it just felt kind of awkward. So this one I don't like. I mean, if I eat something, I won't need to kind of move, react. This one's kind of a, nah, not interesting. But again, you can do this if you like. The other one was a focus bag, a focus ball, uh, which you can see. You probably know this from different movies. <laughs> I haven't tried it myself. And you can try to do different tricks and evade, uh, which is pretty cool. Again, different game modes is nice. It's not game mode, actually, it's just practice. But 
but it's nice to kind of uh, change from time to time. Sometimes when I'm after a fight, very intensive fight, I want to kind of uh, just lower it a bit, you know, because my muscles hurt. Uh, so this is probably one of the things that I do. Uh, nice, nice, nice feature. Now there's also one mode they created for Halloween, kind of fighting against the ghost, but this one is very hard, by the way. Uh, I didn't finish this one, but <laughs> uh, probably going to do this later on, maybe this week. Uh, so again, different modes, hopefully we're going to see more updates uh, and maybe different game modes, but overall it's feel fine as it is. Uh, again, I just wish the controller have forced feedback, so it really feel kind of a, you know, feel like more realistic. But already this is a great uh, virtual reality, realistic boxing game, and it costs $9.99, $10 on the Oculus Store, so I definitely this one worth uh, your investment if you have, of course, the supported headset and... You want to do workout as well or i mean you want to do workout as well this is one is great for workout yeah so this is it just say if you wonder if there is anything like this or you're having a virtual reality headset and haven't discovered this game check it out on the oculus store again thanks for watching everyone consider subscribing to my channel and give this one a little like and i see you very soon on the next video thanks for watching everyone cheers bye bye